Northern two-lined salamanders can be found in swift-moving woodland streams and rivers. They have an interesting life cycle. Their eggs are laid on the underside of stream rocks, making them ideal for observing their development. Females lay clutches of one to two dozen white eggs. Embryos develop quickly. After about a week, they are already complete salamanders inside the jelly coating. Looking closely, you can see the head, tiny limbs, and tail. They are tiny. They're less than one centimeter. They must be about half of a centimeter in length. Every once in a while, you'll see one swim around inside the egg. But if I zoom way in, that's as far as we can go, you can see the head, the larger end, and then all the tails. After hatching, larval two-lined salamanders spend two years in an underwater larval stage. They are difficult to spot below the turbid water surface. Their mottled brown coloration blends well with the stream bed. They breathe through gills and dwell in the same stream or river where they were born. They feed on underwater invertebrates and insects. Adult salamanders become terrestrial but remain near the stream beds where the earth is moist and access to water is easy. Adults have two distinct black lines running down their body, with small black dots on top of a rusty yellow skin. Be on the lookout in your community for this small but remarkable amphibian.